new videos every day. So today we're going to demonstrate the herky. I'm going to walk you through some stretches and show you the proper way to perform this jump. So here's what it should look like. So first off, this is what you're supposed to look like in the air when you're performing a herky. So a stretch that you can do is obviously sitting in the position that you're supposed to be and then just stretching over this leg. Because if you stretch this right here, it's going to help you snap your leg up into the position that you want it to go. So you, yeah, you just lean over and hold it and back up. And then you always want to be sure to stretch out your other leg too so you'll be equally flexible. So you just lean over on your left, reach, and relax. Another stretch to help with herkies is just one leg in front of the other, back leg bent, and just lean down. You're definitely going to feel a stretch right in here, underneath your thigh. Just lean down and bring it back up, switch it over to the other side. Same thing, just lean down. Feels really good when you're sore. And bring it back up. If you'd like to see more stretches, refer back to my five minute and 10 minute follow along stretching videos. Okay, now I'm gonna walk you through the entire herky jump. So your starting position should be legs together, and the entire jump is an eight count, so there's different positions that you have to hit throughout the entire eight count. So first, you're going to start off five, six, seven, eight. You're going to clap one, two. Then you're going to jump up into a high V on three, four. Swing your arms around five, six. Hit the jump on seven, eight. And then clean one, two. Okay? So without your legs, it's going to look something like this. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and back up. Okay? So, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, swing. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Clap. One, two, a three, four, swing. Five, six, seven, eight. There you go. While you're performing this jump, a lot of your power comes from your arms, so it's a good idea to keep your arms really stiff and straight. So when you're going into the jump, you want to jump up on one, swing them around, and hit a T. And then the rest of the power will go into your body, which is going to help you go up more. So you definitely want to keep that in mind. So I'll show you guys one more time. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. So if you've been trying this jump for a while, just keep stretching. I promise you, you'll get it. It'll help you, it, stretching helps you prevent injury, and it'll also help you snap your leg up there so much farther. So just keep stretching, just keep going at it, keep trying the jump every day. It'll help, I promise. Be sure to stay tuned for my future videos where I'll show you a tuck, a front hurdler, and lots of other moves. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Leave a comment, thumbs up, and subscribe. Bye.